Step into Rio, where Samba flows alongside streams of data. Imagine standing in the carnival streets, drums pounding while servers hum nearby. This city, once crowned by kings and saints, now experiments with algorithms. Brazil proves joy isn't erased by machines. Instead, joy becomes the data that trains them. Here, code doesn't compete with rhythm. It dances with it, learning from every beat. From murals in favelas to glowing labs, Rio shows how resilience and creativity merge into code. Each drumbeat feels like a signal, each step a sequence, each festival a data set. AI doesn't just learn from equations, but from emotions and living culture. And here, the lesson is clear. Culture feeds technology, and technology, in return, magnifies culture, amplifying voices from Rio's carnival to the digital world. Look up at Sao Paulo's skyline, once a symbol of finance and factories, now a beacon of digital ambition. Behind the glass towers, incubators, and startups fuel a new economy of innovation and growth. What once moved on paper ledgers now flows as encrypted code and connected data streams. This city blends ambition with access, proving how concrete jungles can give birth to digital rainforests. In coffee shops, coders brainstorm next to bankers over steaming cups. From fintech hubs to AI-driven logistics, Sao Paulo thrives on reinvention and adaptability. This city refuses to choose between old wealth and new code. Instead, it merges them into one evolving rhythm of progress and connection. Brazil's digital carnival isn't once a year. It marches daily through boardrooms, classrooms, creative studios, and busy streets. Imagine flying above the Amazon, a living computer breathing with every leaf and river, each ecosystem alive with hidden codes. Scientists here use AI to decode rainfall, biodiversity, and climate, turning natural cycles into streams of insight. What some call wilderness, Brazil calls wisdom. Algorithms don't just crunch numbers. They translate the language of the forest. In Amazonia, data isn't mined. It's grown, nurtured, endlessly renewed. When satellites scan the canopy and drones track animal paths, the rainforest becomes both teacher and textbook for a global classroom. Its vastness humbles technology, reminding us that every data set depends on living systems that breathe and grow. Brazil proves that AI can learn not only efficiency, but also balance and care. Here, nature isn't background noise. It's the loudest, clearest, and most vital signal of all. Step into Mumbai, where movement never pauses, and the city feels alive at every corner. Crowds surge through stations, markets burst with color, and glowing screens fill late-night offices. To the outside eye, it looks like chaos without order. But to AI, it's choreography. Millions of data points moving in rhythm. In Mumbai, disorder reveals itself as design, persistence shaping every algorithm in motion. Coders here don't work apart from the city's pulse. They work inside it, drawing strength from the crowded rhythm. Every rush hour train and street becomes an inspiration for resilient systems. Mumbai teaches AI that scale matters, but survival matters more. This city isn't just adapting to technology, it's training it, proving how resilience turns noise into knowledge and chaos into working, living, breathing code. Now, picture Bengaluru, India's Silicon Valley, humming with ambition and growing by the day. Startups sprout overnight, while global companies plant deep roots expanding across districts and shaping a new digital future. But behind the code lies culture, philosophy, family, tradition, and food shaping every innovation. This city doesn't just write software, it writes a blueprint for India's digital independence and resilience. 
Here, coffee shops double as classrooms, and late-night hackathons feel like festivals of possibility and energy. AI isn't seen as foreign technology, but as part of India's long tradition of logic, mathematics, and invention. Bengaluru proves that modern dreams don't erase ancient roots. They strengthen them, connecting global ambition with cultural memory. Innovation thrives where people remember history, ensuring technology is built on living wisdom. Stand on the banks of the Ganges at sunrise, where light reflects across the sacred water. Ancient hymns rise as data streams fall, blending two kinds of knowledge. Varanasi shows that not all wisdom lives in circuits. Here, centuries of philosophy remind us that wisdom is more than calculation. AI can simulate speed and scale, but in India's oldest city, it learns deeper lessons. Pilgrims and programmers share the same horizon, one seeking eternity, the other seeking innovation and purpose. Varanasi proves that progress isn't abandoning tradition, it's carrying it forward with pride and continuity. Algorithms may process numbers, but people process meaning, compassion, and community. Here, ancient rivers guide modern minds, reminding technology that wisdom is found not only in logic, but also in shared humanity. Brazil moves through drums, India through mantras, Yet both pulse with the same energy and vision. Festivals here aren't distractions, but declarations of culture, of resilience and of identity that endures through time. AI learns that data has a heartbeat and rhythm shapes memory. When nations dance and pray, machines finally see that progress isn't built only in labs, but also in streets alive with soul. Together, Brazil and India prove that innovation is richer when rooted deeply in heritage. One teaches joy through rhythm, the other through philosophy and reflection, but both keep humanity at the center. And now, what about your nation? Where will your rhythm teach AI next, inspiring a new generation? Share your thoughts below. Your comment becomes part of this global and ongoing conversation. Festivals may end, but their music lingers in memory and tradition. Nations may change, but their wisdom carries on from one generation to the next. AI is the newest guest at this celebration, learning not from textbooks alone, but from people who live with rhythm, song, and reflection. Brazil and India show the world that progress without culture is empty, but culture shared with progress becomes unstoppable. From Rio's dancers to Varanasi's prayers, one lesson echoes across borders and centuries. Machines can calculate, but only humanity can celebrate. AI must not only process speed, it must preserve soul, memory, and meaning. In this festival of nations, the dance never ends, continuing as technology and tradition weave together. The invitation is open to all, reminding us that progress is a shared story 